It's a huge week for some former Iowa football players and their futures in the league. First up with the media on Tuesday was Nate Stanley. Hawkeye headquarters reporter Adam Rosso tells us how the quarterback is refining his technique to prepare for the NFL. How can you be more consistent? What are you doing to, to get to that point? Nate Stanley knew the questions would come at the NFL Combine. He needed to have answers. I feel really confident with, with how those meetings went and uh, you know, looking forward to, to continuing this process and, and getting to know teams even better. Consistency and accuracy are a must in the National Football League. So Stanley began working with quarterback specialist Tony Rassiopi shortly after the Holiday Bowl. I was just throwing a, a football like I, was, I would throw a baseball when I was a kid. Really trying to fix some of the, the mechanics of my lower half of my body uh, to make sure I'm not overstriding. Um, using my hips to generate power instead of trying to, trying to bend at my waist or use my elbow. It's more refining than overhauling his mechanics. A layer deeper than what was offered by Iowa quarterbacks coach Ken O'Keefe. He's great with the X's and O's, um, but I just felt that the explanation of, of you know, why you miss throws wasn't always there. Stanley's reboot comes after one of the most productive quarterback careers in Iowa history. The Draft Network's Jordan Reed says Stanley's entire body of work should make him a late round pick this April. The thing you want to see him improve upon is just the consistency. There were some open throws that he did miss from time to time, but there's some tight window throws where he has, he has a lot of courage in order to throw those throws. Stanley says he's had informal interviews with about 25 NFL teams here in Indy. Most have been introductory, but he did say he got on the board and went through plays and schemes with a few teams as he tries to become the third quarterback taken in Kirk Ferentz's tenure. Reporting from Indianapolis, Adam Rosso for Hawkeye Headquarters. And Adam's coverage will continue all week from the Combine.